All right, guys, so super easy video. Uh, what we're doing right now, we are going to um, add some emulators to our modded PSP and toss some ROMs in there as well. So go ahead, uh, plug your PSP in to your computer with the uh, charger cable, whatever you want to call that. And uh, go ahead and open it up. All right. So, next what we want to do is grab some em emulators. Um, get those basically anywhere. So, emulators. Let's go ahead and do Nintendo 64. Oops, hold on. Alright, so first what we want to do here, actually go to PSP, go to Game, Now. N64, and if you notice the light on your PSP is blinking now because uh, it's accepting the data. All right, so N64 is now on there. Let's go ahead and do uh, NES as well. Okay. We'll go ahead and um, add a few ROMs. There's already a couple in these, but let's go ahead... How big is that one? Just because the bigger the file. We'll do Batman Beyond. That's how you transfer ROMs. There's, you know, a ROM folder already in the majority of the emulators you're going to download. So let's go ahead and head over to the PSP. Alright guys, so now that we're on the PSP, let's go ahead and we'll exit out of USB mode. And now we're going to go over to the game folder. Memory stick, as you can see. Go ahead and load up the uh, NES. And here's the ROM folder. And of course, circle is OK. So we'll press circle and there we have it. Adding emulators and ROMs to your modified PlayStation Portable. And there you have it. So guys, that's the video. If you liked it, go ahead like the video. If you want to see more content like this, subscribe to the channel. Um, other than that, that's the video. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it.